A lot of designers like to have a newsletter block in the first section of their footer in order to advertise a freebie or a workshop or bootcamp they're running and to build up their email list. But you may find that you don't want this section to display on certain pages of your site. So for example, if you have a page that you're advertising your freebies on, you might not want a freebie also then advertised in the footer. So it'll seem a little bit redundant. And so you wanna hide that section of the footer just on that particular page. If you're new here, my name is Rebecca from Rebecca Grace Designs, and I provide tips and tricks for designing in Squarespace. In this video, we're gonna talk about how to use CSS in order to hide just one section of a footer on a specific page in Squarespace. So let's jump in. So here in Squarespace 7.1 on the home page, in the footer at the bottom, we have a newsletter block. And this is a popular place to put this because the footer displays on every page of the website. And so we tend to put um, some advertising things in that first section, such as a newsletter or advertising a workshop or a bootcamp or something that we're, we have going on. Um, but you may find there's some pages where you don't want this first section to display. You're not trying to create a cover page where you're hiding the whole header and footer. You just don't want this first section to display. So what you're going to do is go to the page that you want to hide the footer on. So for example, maybe on this take action page, um, I don't want the newsletter on this page for whatever reason. Maybe I have a section already advertising it um, with a bit more information. And so it seems a little redundant to have it in the bottom. You're going to click the gear icon next to the page and select advanced. And because we're writing CSS in this section, we have to put in style tags. So we're going to put in um, a style tag, opening and closing. And then inside, we're going to put footer so that we're targeting the footer. And then page section, I'm calling the page section class. And I'm going to use nth of type, and in my case, one. So that one will determine which section it's going to hide. So if you want the second section to hide, you're going to put a two in there, the third section a three, and so on. But I want my first section, so I'm going to put a one. I'm going to put an open bracket, display none, closing bracket. So I've targeted the footer. I want the first page section in the footer to display none. And then we always like to put a little note for ourselves. So I'm going to put a open bracket explanation point dash dash. Put a little note for myself and then dash dash closing bracket. You'll notice it's grayed out because that's a note for me. We like to put this in our code so we can keep organized or remember what that code is for. Now I'm going to click save. And you'll see that just that first section of the footer is hidden, but I still have my bottom links. So now that you know how to hide just that one section of your footer on a specific page, check out this next video where I show you everything you need to know to set up a newsletter in Squarespace.